Hey kids, welcome back to Learn with Maktum. So in this video, we are going to continue with the first standard mathematics, the chapter number 16, that is weight. So in this chapter, we will be studying about the difference between the thin and thick and also the difference in the light objects and the heavy objects. Okay, so let us start the chapter by examples. Okay, kids. So first consider these two books here okay so you can check out here this book is thick this book is thick whereas this book if you consider this is thin okay this is thin clear with that okay so I hope you understood this is a thin book this is thick book okay yeah the same way if you consider this duster and this pencil so which one is thin here this is a thin object whereas duster is thick object okay yes so now considering these examples a marker and a sketch pen the sketch pen is thin and the marker is thick. Yes or no? Okay. So the same way, if I tell you to lift this, the duster is having what? It is having highest weight. Yes or no? Comparing with the pencil. Pencil is light. Yes, it is lightweight. Whereas duster is a bit heavy. Okay. The same way, this book is light. Lightweight. This book is having heavy. Yes, this book is heavy. So, this is having highest weight compared to this book. Yes, clear with this? The same way if you consider these things, the marker is heavy, whereas the sketch pen is light. Okay, I hope you got it. So, let's see the textbook examples. Yes. So, the lesson number 16, weight. So, firstly, we are studying the difference between the thick and thin. So, you can see this is thick object. This is thin object. So, here, what is this? It is an elephant. Yes. So, here, the elephant tail. Yes. The tail of an elephant is thin. Whereas, the legs of an elephant are thick. Yes or no? The same way, the rope is bit thick compared to the thread. Three two, the rope is nagi de thick nagi de. Even the dara thin nagi rta de. Three two. Yes, here. Color the thick ones. So, here you have to color the thick ones. I have marked the thick ones here. So, here out of these two books, which is thick one? This is thick one. So, color this. So, here two pencils. Which one is thick? This one is thick. The same way here soap. Which one is a thick soap? This one. And candle? This is thick candle. Okay, now we have to circle the thin ones. So, out of these two, which is thinner? This is thinner. So, circle this. And here, this is thinner. Clear with that? Here, we have to tick the thick object. Thick one. So, here, these two. This is thick. This is thin. So, we have to tick here. Okay. So, this is thick object. Now, here. Out of these two, this is thin and this is thick. So, we have to tick this. Okay, now, tick the thick object. So, here, this one is thin. This is thick. So, we have to put right mark here. Then, crayon and the small crayon. So, this one is thick and this one is thin so we have to tick here 
now i have already explained about heavy and light yes so the rock holding by this boy is heavy yes the piece of wood is light and the feather is light the doll is heavy the pumpkin is heavy orange is light okay now tick the heavy ones so there is a dog and a cat which one is heavy the dog is heavy okay here which one is heavy this one is heavy this is lighter yes or no this is light but this is heavy yes or no so heavy this is a large book and a small book so this book is large means it is heavy okay now circle the light object so here out of these i have circled already other others are what others are heavy ones okay bucket and uh, this uh, crayons bundle and pumpkin and the lock all are heavy but these are light ones clear with this so kids hope you understood the, about the chapter weight yes we studied about thin and thick heavy and light okay in the next chapter in the next video we will see the next chapter that is time okay hope you like this video i am going to see you in the next video with the next chapter till then take care bye bye